What's up, YouTube? This is your boy, Jess Tim Johnson. Thank you all for tuning in to the tribe. I appreciate each and every one of you all for taking time out of your hour, your day, your week, or your schedule to view this content. I truly appreciate that. We're going to talk about today the sleeper Jordan of 2021. Before I get started with that, I want to give a special shout out to my man, Keep Pushing Kicks. If you don't follow him on Instagram, I suggest you do that. Keep Pushing Kicks. All one word. So I'm going to drop his information down in the, the description portion. And subscribe to his YouTube channel. That brother took time out of one of his days this week to give me some insightful feedback on what I can do to get you all better content. And, you know, I kind of felt like Kobe did in the last dance documentary when he was talking about MJ. And Kobe had referenced asking MJ in 98 about his turnaround jumper and how Michael Jordan gave him a very detailed answer. And Mike left as, hey, if you need something, man, holler at me. That's how KPK made me feel. He felt I felt like he was my Michael Jordan, and I'm going to be his Kobe. So uh, rest in peace to the Black Mamba, too. So more on that in a later video. But I'm definitely going to drop his information down. Please go follow my brother over on IG and subscribe to his YouTube channel. All right? In addition to that, now, so getting back to our content, we're talking about the Sleeper Jordan of 2021. Now, there's a few sneakerheads and a few content creators that may or may not have gotten it right. So I want to give you all my perspective on that. All right, so I'm gonna first show y'all the clip from what I consider number five, and this is the one, shout out to Flight Academy Kicks, that he said was the sleeper Jordan of 2021. So let me show y'all that clip right now. So this part of the video, I'm shooting on November the 25th, 2021, right before the Cowboys game. All right, just to kind of give you all my perspective on what we're discussing on this topic of this overall video today, which is the sleeper Jordan of 2021. Now, I just wanted to give y'all a quick synopsis of what I think. The, now, according to Flight, earlier this year, now, I want to see on his next live that we tune in. If you are not already subscribed to Flight Academy Kicks, please do so now. Follow Flight Academy Kicks and Flight Academy Kicks LAL on IG. This is a, a shoe I caught from Shoe Palace. See the receipt. And this is the shoe that Flight said earlier this year was the sleeper of 2021. And I actually got that recorded too. So this is the Air Jordan 1 Patina or the Darth Vader, as some people have been calling it. So overall, it's not a bad shoe. It's just, you know, I wasn't too particular about it. Uh, I'm filming this content right now because this shoe is going out the door before I actually upload and edit the rest of this video about my sleeper Jordan of 2021. I just wanted to give y'all a quick B-roll of this one. All right, so this is overall clean shoe. It's just, you know, it's not... For me, one person's victory garden is another person's bomb site. So that's as the saying goes. So I do want to see if Flight is going to keep this as his top sleeper of the year. All right. Now, in addition to that, um, as I was discussing a few moments ago, we're going to go ahead and get back into what the other sleeper joins of 2021 and that discussion. I'm going to give you all my number one coming up now. Okay. So we just saw number five which was the Pantina one, which Flight Academy Kicks determined to be the sleeper Jordan of 2021. Before I get to the rest of the countdown, I want to show y'all the honorable mention, which was the sleeper Jordan of 2020. This is the Hyper Royal and Black Air Jordan 13 that came out December of last year. Look, y'all see that 3M popping? This joint is clean. These are a lot of people slept on these. Come this summer and after the purple ones release, and it depends on how that release go, people are going to be wishing they had this one. All right, this was definitely a sleep of 2020 combined with the Black Cat 4. All right, more on that in a later video. So getting back to the list, we saw number five, which was the Pantina. I'm going to show y'all what I consider number four. All right, this is the Electric Green, which is patterned after the Oregon PE for the University of Oregon, the Air Jordan 6 for that. Now, I don't have the Oregon logo back here or the Oregon uh, stamps on it, but this was overall clean shooting. A lot of people slept on it. Come next summer... Uh, tax time, they're going to be wishing they had that one. That's number four. Number three, shout out to my man, Rep Milwaukee 414. He said that this was going to be the sleeper Jordan of the year, the Obsidian 13. Break also said this could possibly, shout out to Unbreakable Kicks, could be the sleeper Jordan of 2021 as well. Now, this is a clean shoe. This is definitely number three. Like, this is a dope colorway. If you missed out on the He Got Games or if you missed out on the Flints, this is definitely a must-have in the collection. All right, so that's number three. Number two. Now, this is a Jordan that a lot of people slept on, and they're going to be looking for this probably around October this year. 
That Jordan is this one right here. All right. This is the what they dubbed as the Shattered Backboard 13 with the black sock liner. It's still dead stock. Okay. This was a clean shoe. This released January of this year. That just goes to show you now. Some of y'all looking at this shoe right now and be like, man, I forgot that shoe even released this year. I do that myself. That just shows you how many, we so focused on the shoes that we didn't get, we forget sometimes about the shoes that we potentially could overlook or the shoes that we get that we consider sleepers. This is definitely like that tumble leather. Like some of y'all might not be fans of 13s, but for those of us that are, like this is a clean 13, all right? You ain't got to worry about the sock liner getting dirty because it got that black sock liner. So that's not a problem. The hair and bone or whatever this is down here, the traction pad, that's orange and black like the shattered backboard colorway. Now, I believe this was a starfish color. Don't quote me on that. I'm going to have to look at the box. But, yeah, this was a clean Jordan, all right? And this is definitely the number two sleeper of 2021, all right? Now, I also want to give a special shout-out to my man, Got Him Cards, all right? He has a Discord group. If you're not following him on IG, I don't know what you're doing. For those of us that continually, continuously miss out on these releases, go follow my man, Got Him Cards. He gives you up-to-the-minute real-time insight on the sneaker industry, how to buy, how to purchase. He has a Discord group. There's a purchase price for that. And it's not, I wouldn't want to say it's a Discord. It's more of a village because it gives you that feeling of you, you around friends and family and you around other tribe members. So definitely salute to God and Cots in the Discord. Uh, you know, it, it stay popping over there in the VIP chat. Plus they're giving us real-time insight as to when daily releases, when raffles, restocks, all that type of stuff. Like if you're looking for the PlayStation 5 digital or the this console, the Xbox console, head on over there because that might be your last chance to get it before we wrap up this holiday season. Getting back to the content at hand, I'm going to give y'all the number one sleeper of 2021. The Red Flint 13. All right, this is patterned after the Kevin Martin PE. He played for the Houston Rockets. He had a PE that had his Kevin Martin logo up here. You got, you got the Flint Gray midsole, the white uh, paw pads with the red where it's blue at. And you compare this to the uh, last year release, which was the Flint 13. We got that OG release, re-released. This is that demonstration right here. This is the sneaker, the Jordan 2021 sleeper of the year. All right? Now, some of y'all might not be a fan of the red. I empathize with you. You know, it is what it is. But for those of us that can stand to wear a red shoe and can see themselves patterning this, this shoe going to be that business next summer, all right? This, the price going to start creeping up on this and people going to be like, I should have purchased that shoe. That's right. And it was neck and neck between this one and this one, all right? But this is the sleeper Jordan of 2021. All right, I'm going to send this over to my man, Sniper Jones. I'm going to send this over to my man, Chaotic Kicks. Y'all both subscribe to their YouTube channels. I'm going to shoot this over to Flight 2. Subscribe to Flight Academy Kicks YouTube channel because I want to see what they got to say as far as what my sleeper Jordan of 2021 20, is. All right? Let's see what they have to say about this. All right? I want to hear what you all have to say in the comments as well. So, you know... Speak, speak your mind down in the comments. Let me know what y'all think the sleeper Jordan of 2021 is. Again, the sleeper. What we're saying is when you define a sleeper Jordan, it's what Jordan a lot of people, the masses, mostly slept on that you may have purchased or been chasing that you feel is going to end up having traction at a later time. Even later in the year of 2021, beginning the next year, even two, three years down the line. Comment down. this video, I want to go over a few housekeeping items. I will be doing a collection video once I hit 500 subscribers. So make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend. Come be a member of the tribe. Each one reach one. You know, we support each other, essentially. And then we're going to grow this channel together. Don't forget to leave your feedback down below. Feedback is a gift, okay? I want to thank each and every one of you all for tuning in to Just Tim Johnson. I appreciate you all listening to this content, sharing your insight on what the Sleeper Jordan of 2021 was. I want to hear, I want y'all to just blow the comment section up because I want to hear what everybody is thinking. That's, I, I'm, I'm eager to get this information out there. Don't forget, 
Tell your friends, tell your coworkers, tell your family members. If this video is of any value to you or what we're doing over here is of any value to you, bring them over here. Let them share. We shall walk this mile together, all right? Thank you all. Be safe this weekend. It's the Cool Gray 11 release. I'm going to have a pickup vlog for that. We're going to go with some, uh, we're going to continue to come with these bangers to wrap up the year. Peace.